If you need to locate a specific pin on a chip, you first start with pin number one and count up from there. To find that first pin, look for a marker on the chip's surface, often in the form of a dot in the upper left-hand corner, or a U-shaped notch, or both, or a printed symbol. It does tend to vary. On top of that, many chips have additional unrelated circular indentations, just to make things a bit more confusing. In any case, we have our dot. Pin 1 is always going to be to the left of that marker, and moving counterclockwise from there, the pin numbers always increase. So this 28-pin chip in a dual inline package counts to 14 while going down the left side, then jumps over to the right and counts up to 28. 